And if you are gluten free or vegan, no need to fear. We've got just the place for you. Ash, are you there? T. Hi, Ash. <laughs> We are here, guys, at <laughs> High Tea. Hi, Who. Hi, John. Hanging out at Preston Coffee and Rutgers this morning on uh, just off of L Street. But we are here because we are talking about Brian, uh, Brown Rice Bakery. Brown Rice Bakery is this brilliant, brand new company uh, that is helping us all enjoy something sweet, especially if you have some food sensitivities. We've all been there. Let's bring in Jay, the owner, the creator, the founder. Jay, good morning. Good to see you. Good morning. Thank you for yeah, having me. Absolutely. So I read an article about you, and I thought and I actually felt like I related. I understood where you were coming from uh, when talking about food sensitivities for you during the pandemic. And then all of a sudden you realize, wait, I need to do something. I need to make a change. And that's when Brown Rice Bakery was introduced to the world. Yes, it was. Yeah, I realized that I had gluten, dairy and eggs, egg sensitivities. Oh and I God. really had to drastically change my diet. But I also love sweets. I have a huge sweet tooth. I knew that I didn't want to give that up. So I just started making the things that I couldn't find out available in the world. Yeah, so let's go ahead and show some pictures of you hard at work and some of your, your product. For you, what was it like creating something that you know everyone can enjoy? Once again, if you're vegan, you can enjoy this. If you're gluten-free, you can enjoy this. If, you're, if you have a dairy intolerance, you could enjoy yeah. this. Yeah, it was definitely a lot of trial and error to come up with the recipes. Doing something without gluten is one thing, and then doing something without dairy and eggs also is completely different. So it was a, a lot of trial and error, a lot of research, um, and it really just kind of came with my whole concept of desserts for all, making this something that's an inclusive brand that brings in different parts of the community that lifts up these ideas of community, health, sustainability, and most of all, joy. I love that joy. Listen, if you're not enjoying this and feeling joyful, Something is wrong, right? Um, okay, let's talk about what we have on display this morning. I mean, the first thing, Jay, I'll tell you that I uh, like immediately kind of was drawn to was this. I don't even yes. know what it is. I didn't ask, <laughs> but that looks, that looks scrumptious. Tell me about that. Yeah, so that's the pistachio rose and cardamom cupcake. This is a really delicious combination of flavors. It's an almond flour based cupcake, something that you don't really find everywhere, but that's a really classic and beautiful combination of flavors. Perfect. Let's go ahead and keep it going down. We have to uh, have what's inside the case here. Yeah, so that's my the OG banana bread. That's what everybody <laughs> kind of goes to. It's the very first recipe I created for Brown Rice Bakery, and it's available here at Pressed Coffee and Records pretty much every day that they're open. All right. It sounds, it sounds like it would be fantastic with my coffee, which makes yes. sense as to why it's at press. Uh, but then let's talk about, are those brownies inside? Yeah, yeah. I've got a triple oh. chocolate brownie right oh there. Goodness. It's made with two different types of chocolate. Everything completely, um, you know, real high quality ingredients. Yeah. I don't skimp. I don't go with anything low quality. Got a little sprinkle of uh, malt and salt on there as well. Okay. So I think I'm going to try the banana. You know what? No, we'll try that in a second. But really fast, if you, what advice do you have for people who might be struggling with food sensitivity? but they're not quite sure how to tackle it. Yeah, I think just, you know, be open to different types of foods that might actually be a little better for your body. Yeah. Do a little trial and error. You, you don't have to have, you know, a lot of money to do that. You just kind of got to go with some of these ingredients that honestly have been around for a really long time that a lot of people eat around the world, but weren't necessarily calling gluten free. Sure. You know, sure. OK, OK, uh, we're going to go for this, guys. We're going to wrap it up as I open this up and grab it. Brown rice meaning brown rice quite literally inside the food. Yep, I use okay. a lot of brown rice flour in the food. Mm -hmm. All right, how can people find you? Um, so you can find products here at Press Coffee and Records uh, Wednesday through Sunday, and you can also look me up on Instagram at Brown Rice Bakery, and the website is brownricebakery.com. All right, perfect. We'll make sure to link it all to the website, gooddaysacramento.com. We're going to go for it. Here yes, we go. Yes, please. There it is. Those mm -hmm. brownies mm -hmm. look good. They sure do. Watch your The watch more your chocolate, eyes. Watch more better. Watch and her eyebrows. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so good you're yeah. amazing thank you so much all right guys back on over to you that was good. thank you ash appreciate it all right it is time now for the latest game show this